because my catch rate is appalling now. I'm absolute pants at catching these fish. Oh, there we go. Hey up, VSPVPs, ARC fans, subs, viewers, just anyone who likes watching YouTube videos, whatever they are. <laughs> How's it going? So I'm Voxesto, and we're on the VSPVP server. It's a fan server, sub server, PVP server, whatever you want to call it. And uh, yeah, cheers for coming to watch the video. Chill out with us tonight. We're hanging out on ARC. There's blue drop. There's always a drop come down when I do the intro. It's really weird. Right, so tonight I've got something. I spoke about something I found in the uh, last episode and I didn't show you. Right, are you ready? Because this is going to tell you what we're going to be doing at the start of this episode because I want to go and do it. It's a must. Look what we've got a Mastercraft fishing rod. 308% effectiveness and lots of durability to boot. So I'm proper excited about going fishing now. <laughs> We're going to get loads of blueprints and stuff and it's all going to be business end of the whatever's you call it. We're hooking into some big fish. It's going to be tight lines and wet nets. <laughs> We're going to be kissing them and throwing them. No, we're not going to be kissing them and throwing them back. We're going to be like turning them into crafting blueprints and all sorts of prime fish meat. Maybe even some pearls. Then after that, I think we're going to get deep in the sea and try and sort some stuff out. So, uh, yeah, hope you enjoy the episode, guys. If you do, along the way, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And if you haven't already, don't forget to have a drop drop into the descriptions for the link for the, uh, for the Discord group and stuff like that. So that's cool. You can come join in. There's all that sort of stuff. I'll put my hands up to you. Look, come have a look. That's all I'm going to say. So I'm going to get some stuff together, mm. which I've kind of already got. I'm not going to get some stuff together. I'm just going to get on horse and we are going to, I'm just going to get on horse. We're going. There's nothing else to it. We're getting on a horse. Right, so first things first, we need some leech blood again. They're all out. So, <laughs> just going to crash through the air. Uh, Fresh, fresh through the swamp and just bite the floor as we go and hope we come across a leech. Sometimes we look, Baryonyx. What's he after? A pig? A pig for the bacon for dinner for him? He's a lucky bezler, isn't he? Good old boy. There's nothing wrong with a bit of bacon or a sausage, for that matter. My brother's into his bacon. I like sausages. Not in a. <gasps> look at that, a river monster. No, something killed it. What even killed it? I can't even just see what killed it. Something did. But yeah, so I really like my sausages, like sausage rolls and stuff like that. My brother really likes his bacon. Together we like pigs in blankets. If you don't know what a pig in blanket is, that's like something we have like with roast dinners and Christmas and stuff. Like in England. It's just a little cocktail sausage wrapped in bacon. You can't, you just, you can't beat it, guys. Best of both worlds. Who's this at? Watermelon men. They're not online. Right, so there's a snail. I haven't got, I haven't seen any. Uh, I haven't seen any leeches. Usually see loads along this bank. We'll find them. Don't you worry. We will find them. And we will get lots of blood. And then we will go fishing. <laughs> oh, I thought that was some leeches then. This is what I do. I just run frantically until I actually accidentally sort of kill them. Killed him. Leech. Leech, please. Dilo. Don't he look smaller, that little Dilo? Bless its heart. Bless its cotton little spit valves. <laughs> spit sacks. <laughs> Treasure there. I don't know if I got that. I don't really want to get it. We don't really need it. We don't need leveling for the uh, for old Atlas. He's alright level really, isn't he? Um, leech cheese. Leech seed. 
Leech Cools. Leech Rillion. Leech. Leech. No, it's stone. Okay. Oh, another massive salmon. Oh, it's only a two, but I'd, I'd, I'd happily catch that. We're just killing salmon now. Huh? Oh, sorry about that. My mouse went off screen. Right, well, I'm going to get some... Uh, some some blood. I'm gonna have to find some leaks. It's gonna take forever, so I'll see you when I've got some. Right then, guys. So when I got here, well, when I got that leech blood, it was actually night time. So I fished throughout the night. Caught a couple of little things, not anything too good. Got a couple of blueprints. So I'll show you in a minute. But um, yeah, I'm outside Cleeders and Cooters, and uh, Cooter is online. I don't know if he's spotted that I'm actually here. He might drop by in a minute if he sees me here. He might actually shoot me, I don't know. But um, I thought I'd like, I don't know, I thought I'd film a little bit of fishing, obviously. I said I was going fishing, so I may as well just like show you that I'm actually fishing. Instead of like, well, I don't, re I don't want to record it all, because it's like, I've done a couple of fishing episodes now. I think I've done a couple. I might have only done one on here, but uh, what we'll do is, I'll, I'll catch a couple here, see what we get, and oh. There we go. That oh, was a tiny thing, look. Oh, waste of time. Just, oh. Weren't even pressing. Oh, no. Oh, what a plonk. Look at this, look. I was just killing some fish. This one's going to Valhalla. Straight up, look. That salmon's off. It's like. Oh. Screw this world. I'm going home, boys. I'm going my pond in the clouds. That's where I'm off to. What's it doing? Look at that fish in the sky. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's a salmon. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's like it should have a string. Oh, there it goes. So hopefully we'll hook into one. Hopefully I'll actually catch one as well. Because my catch rate is appalling now. I'm absolute pants at catching these fish. Oh, here we go. Silence of concentration. <laughs> Come on. It's a 1.4. God, that's just added the pressure. Come on. Yes. Oh, look at all that stuff. Let's have a quick look. Oh, I've already got fabricated pistols, ramshackle pike, <gasps> an apprentice long neck. How many pearls have I got now? Four. Well, I've got these as well. I'll actually make them because I could do with them. Apprentice long neck though, that's good and that's a good and let's get back out there. Smash. One more here, and then we'll uh. Oh look at that! Look, I could have that like that. One more here, and then we'll go find a... We'll just hunt a, mo a river monster. Oh, I thought that was going to be a bite then. I just see a little salmon. And then I just see it. There's a massive salmon just to the... Uh, just to the right of the screen. I want him to go... Oh, no, not a piddler. Oh. I just feel like I can't even be bothered to do it. Hmm. Right, we've got this nice little spot here. Where it's a nice tight little spot. Oh, and look, I ha what you have to hook into the smallest thing every time. Really annoying. Oh, I don't want a Procoptodon saddle. Look, there's only like two fish left. I tried to kill all the little ones and I ended up killing some big ones as well, which was annoying. <laughs> Look, there's a 0 0.5 coal just spawned in. Oh, I got salmon. That threw me off a bit. It's a level 115. I wonder if this holds more for us. I wonder if the level makes a difference. It'd be nice if it did, wouldn't it? Oh, we didn't get anything. Decided I would change spot. I've come back to uh, that, that first spot I fished at on this server. 
which is at the uh, Green Abbey, just just next to it on that waterfall. There's like a pool at the bottom, pool in the middle, and a pool at the top on the river, but I like the middle one because you don't get pestered so much by other things, and you can clear it out. So we've just cleared it out. Oh, and there's only a 1.1 in here, a salmon, so... Should be an okay catch by any means. You watch it not be a 1.1. See, look, where did this guy come from? I'll have him though. <gasps> oh yeah, you don't even get like... Oh, oh Procopter. I thought they were Rex saddles then. I see him and I was like, well excited. Oh, journeyman scuba tank though. That's pretty nice. And uh... Oh, a couple of Prentice fabricated snipers. Nice and all. I forgot I had this in like alphabetical mode. <laughs> I was like, why is all my new stuff up there? We may as well chuck in for that uh other guy. Look at that. Prentice fabricated sniper. That's a lot of polymer. Five hundred polymer. We've got some good bits, haven't we really? We ain't done bad. Let me take this out of a... Uh... Take it out of that and then I can see what I actually get at the bottom, can't I? No. no how do you... Unsort. That's the one. That's what we want. Carl, that was good off one fish, look. We got all of that off one fish. See what I mean? Fishing is the way forward, guys. Fishing really is the way forward. You've got to get them good rods to get that good loot. Let it be known. It's got to be that 1.1. Yeah, there it is. Nice. Whoa. Look at all that stuff I got. That was loads of stuff. I feel like... No, I don't feel like chucking that again, actually. There's no point, is there? I think we'll we're, we're just, we're just call it... Call it a day at that. That's what I got. Carno, another RG, Meglers. Oh, that was that was pretty rubbish compared to the last one. Look, we got like clothes and weapons. See, that don't even cost much. We could go home and build that right now. I think we shall. Right. So here's the plan. We're gonna go down to our water tank. We're gonna sort out uh, like a home to live in. I've got to take these flippers off because I literally can't even walk. Hopefully I won't get killed by coldness in the weather. Shouldn't be a problem though. And all we're going to do is uh, parachute over there. Look, I love it how I'm in third person view and I've still got my goggles on. <laughs> What's going on everybody? <laughs> Bye base. <laughs> oh, is that a red drop? Oh, hope it wasn't. But, um, oh, K look, even K-Mode has the goggles on. Ridiculous. It's not even hurting me having, like, I've only got my gloves and my trousers on. Oh, my health is going down. Okay, that's fair enough. Um, yeah, I should, I may as well put my goggles back on, actually. I'm not going to put any scuba gear on yet, though, because I don't want to ruin its durability. Oh, look, there she is. <gasps> There she is. She is awesome. She is absolutely awesome. We're going to go swim with you and make you a home. Um, right, so try and level this up, but I think... I don't want to be too far out in case... Yeah, there's a manta over there. Should be alright. we we'll just wiggle this way a little bit. I don't want to hit any rocks though, that'll do. Let's drop. Jobs are good and flippers are on, so we're proper fast swimming. Any dangers? No, no dangers lurking. Right, oh, straight on a level up as well. It's got to be health, hasn't it? Look at that, lovely health. And, apparently, this is the thing, this is the cool thing about them. If you keep at the surface, they regenerate health, like, super fast. I mean, that's not bad. You don't even have to, like, force feed them or anything. 
you can't beat it really well I don't think you can so we're going to go to the uh, we're going to go to a cave we're going to set up in a cave hopefully she'll fit in and uh, that's where she's going to live hopefully it's not too deep because apparently these guys lose health when they're too deep as well but uh, we'll see so this is a cave I used like back in the day like on PvP and that and uh, I'll, sh I'll show you where it is it's really easy to get to so you get to this little bit here where it sort of make comes to the lagoon and then you just head straight out to sea literally just go down and then you should start seeing like mm, okay so this is deeper than I remembered yeah so here we go should start seeing all this oil and stuff down here Look, that lump there, that's our cave. So we'll see what happens, we'll see if she can get in there. If she can, we'll see if like she can stop losing health and stuff, because that's not good. Yeah, she gets in there. And she still loses health. But does she lose as much as she gains? Oh no, I don't think we're going to be able to do this. Hmm. That's a shame. You'd have thought they'd sorted that out so you could actually have them down there. Yeah, I don't really know what's going on there. It's like, it's a bit up and down, isn't it? Well, let's just quickly round up all these pearls and stuff while we're down here because there's absolute abundance of pearls and I could actually just place my stuff down here and just have it as like pearl storage and just like spawn in here just to get my pearls and that so I've always got absolutely all the pearls I'll ever need and I'll tell you what we will be getting this for the uh, XP boost Let's just check her health because we don't want her to die. No, look, it's all right. It's staying there, isn't it? Let's just jump on and see what that is. Oh, it's only gone down a little bit. So we know she's all right to just sit here while we uh, bosh this stuff in. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place this stuff like right over here. Like that. One of them there. We want a bed. We'll just place that at the back. Like so. We want the walls. And the door. And the door. And we want... What else do we want? We want that. We'll have that. And... Uh, that we can just hit E, we don't have to put that on hotbar. Open that up. Oh, got my crossbar, accidental. And my hatchet. I'm bad at pressing keys today, ain't I? Right, so that's alright for our little hut. Now what I want to do is, I just want to place this here. Drop a vault on it. Well, we can just put it right close to it. Don't matter. And then we're just going to demolish this. And that can be our vault. I'm gonna pop them in there for now. A couple of scubas. And then uh and then we'll go place this down the bottom. And hopefully she'll be able to get in a, in and out of it. What you like? Oh she's alright look. It is going down ever so slowly though, so it's a little bit annoying. Oh, we could, could have actually done with having some foundations here to raise this up. I don't know if I'll bother placing it, to be honest. We might get one. I've done a video on this. I'm so terrible at it. That'll do. That'll, that'll stop Thames from coming in and wild dinos from coming in. Just make sure she can get through it is all we need to worry about. Come 
come on, mate. I'll, I'll get you back up out of the water. No, okay. So, that's a complete write-off. Looks like I'm demolishing that and taking it back. A bit of a shame, but... There's only one way to find out, isn't there? Whoop! Mega jump! Ah. Oh. Watch this mega jump. Whoa! He's like a dolphin! He's like a real life dolphin! I'm just gonna plop these in there as well. Shut that door. We use that. We'll spawn in there every now and then just to get some uh, bits and bobs. And then when we need to, we can just bat down here and get the uh, pearls, all the pearls we need. Is there anything going on down there? No. Let's go explore then. We'll just leave her on the shore for now. I'm sure she'll be okay. Oh, look, here we go. We'll take this Megalodon on. A battle of strength. Come out, Mr. Megalodon. Level 35. I'm sure we'll get level up from it. Yeah, of course we did. Loads of anglerfish. Oh, she ain't struggling anymore, so that's nice. Let's get this guy. Yeah, you didn't see us coming, did you? Massive whale thing. You get loads of megalodon teeth. Uh, level up. Why not get to 20k health, eh? Hopefully, we'll be able to find some pleasies and some, like, moses and that. We'll see if we can kill them, because if we can, we'll get loads of levels out of them. So let's have a surface. Make sure she's all good. Do you know what? I might actually take them goggles off, because they're a little bit annoying, aren't they? Can I see just as good? Yeah, I think I can see just as good with them. Well, without them. I remember they used to be really good, and then they patched it one day, and they're pretty much the same, so there's, like, just no point in having them. Yeah, you got coshed in, mate. No worry about that. Did a big rainbow jump. Yeah. Whee. <laughs> Love it. Right, so I'm going to just do a random explore, really. See if I can find something cool, and I'll be back when I do. Oh, it's just attacked by megalodons, and then this pleasy turned up out of the blue. <laughs> I just finished killing the megalodons, and then, uh... Oh, it's a 130 as well. Oh, what a shame. <laughs> yeah, I finished killing the megalodons, and I was like, Why is something still biting me? This is peculiar. Massive battle. Two awesome water tames. Well, water dinos against each other, pitted to the death. Who will come out victorious? I mean, if we get damaged, we can just go to the surface and get more health and come back and finish it off. So, I think it's a sure shot, guys. We'll definitely get the level ups we want out of this. If it was 150, I'd probably try and leave it alone, though. Look at that, fireworks as well. Set them off when we get home. Alright, so it's going to have to be back up to... I can't believe it was on its own. Get back up to the surface. Look, electric eels. Oh, let's sort them out. I don't like them. Oh, there's another one. Oh, another one of our guys. Yeah, you ain't got nothing on me, mate. Yeah, that's it. Get running. Silly thing. Yeah, you do all your crazy attacks and stuff, and it don't even mean anything, does it? I want to have a look at that other... other basilisk, or whatever they're called. Basilfish. Tarragonosaurus. I've got to get rid of these eels first, though. I'll see if the old trick for uh, using your spyglass underwater works. Oh, I didn't even bring it with me, did I? Oh yeah, I did, there it is. Did they fix it? 
No, they didn't. Right, I'll show you, I'll show you how I used to do it. Because there used to be a way to do it. I don't know if everyone knows this. Because no one used to know how to do it. Right, so what you do is, you've got to equip it first. And then get on. And then when you go to pull it out underwater. You can do it. Now you might be thinking, what? I've, I've tried that before and it don't work. Now what you have to do is, you don't press your hotkey again. Because you've got it equipped already, you press Q. And then you can use it, look. That saves your day, won't it? What do you think about that? Look at this, how weird is this? Killing pleasies in the, in the middle of the night underwater. It's crazy, isn't it? Look at that. I kill pleasies all day, don't worry about it. Pleasey kill more. <laughs> Pleasey kill some more. <laughs> level 35, that's effectively level 1 for a pleasy, so that's like rubbish. I'm looking for some of them little crabby things what live like on the bottom. I've not seen one yet. Because I think you can get black pearls off them. Because our ultimate goal for underwater stuff is uh, get black pearls. And uh, try and get a squid. Look, another pleasy. Pleasy, stop spawning in. Level 60. That should have a buddy. Where its buddy is, well, I just don't know. Thriller bites. Look, we got them down there. Get some oil, silica pearls off them. Oh, look, here they all come. Dolphins getting involved. Look, I can't even get... Ah, that's better. I was going to say, I can't even turn around to attack this guy. Go away, dolphins. You're not supposed to be part of this. An anglerfish? We'll kill some anglerfish, why not? Yeah, we'll just come at my front part. <laughs> oh, look, it's running away. Come back. I summoned thee back. Oh, look at all that angler gel. Alright, let's do some damage. We're on patrol. We're cushing and boshing. Cruising along the bottom of the ocean. I hope it's bright enough for you guys. I think it is. Looking for those crazy crabs. Right. That rock over there. You see that pillar? Over there. A Mosa just like ripped round it. There it is, look. Oh, look, is that an Alpha? Right. Alpha Mosa time. Let's see how we get on. I don't know how this is going to go. This could go absolutely terrible. But it could also go really well. So let's try and get rid of this guy first. Because he's like properly in our way. And all these jellyfish then. Come on. But then once all these are dead. We'll, uh, we'll see if we can take on an Alphamosa. I mean if we can and we can kill it. I mean we've still got the... Uh, We've still got the buff going because I just went in another cave, so this could be good. It could end in tears though. Oh wow, he's like really fast. Alright, yeah, just sit still. Just sit still, mate. Let's just have a munch on each other. A little chat. A little munch. Nothing to worry about. Actually, I'm just going to do that level up on a melee. So I can just hit him a bit harder while we're doing this. Because what I'm thinking is, when, when it all gets a bit too much and we have to go up for some... Uh, go up for some air, a little bit of healing, we can just sort of come back down and then we'll be alright. What do you reckon? I think, I think we're going to be alright, guys. I don't know how long, how easily we're going to be able to tell if he's actually bloody though, because looking at him, he's he, he's pretty black. Unless unless under his chin gets a bit mucky, we ain't really going to know about it, are we? Also got to time it pretty well with like trying to get out of his way. 
It's obviously he's faster than us. So, uh, what was that a Dunkers or? Oh, well, that's the first one I spotted. That's random. So, it doesn't yet look like he is bloody. So this could go on for a ve very, very long time. So I'm just going to crack on with it, and then I'll, uh, I'll join you when we get back. Well, unfortunately, I've had to come up to get some uh, force feeding going on. Because I thought if I force feed as well as like be up here, I can super fast heal. But I think we're going to run out of the time buff for the XP, which is a little bit annoying. But we should still get quite a lot of XP. Because look, we're, we only need 1,500 to get. Well, we only need like. 100 to get to the next level so we're definitely going to get a level out of it we're heading back down hopefully he's still damaged hopefully he didn't heal like quicker than we could heal because that'd be annoying if that's the case i won't be able to kill it because i'll need to get more dps in i'll tell you what if we can just get him to come up a little bit so i don't take that damage we'd we'll definitely be all right because I think half the damage might have been because of how deep we were. Because you sort of get hurt if you go a little too deep. Do you want to come have a look, mate, or what? What are you doing? I'll bite your tail. Yeah, yeah, I will, mate. Alright, we know we can go this high. We're safe here, so... Oh, okay, so he didn't want to go that high. Come on, mate. Come have a fight. Just want to go a little bit higher, really, just in case, but... Oh, it looks like he's still bloody. Oh, he's got to be struggling, look. Look at that. He's got, like, red sauce all over his nose. Chest looks all bad, bruising. Look at that. 
bruising. <laughs> Just realised I said bruising. Don't know what bruising is. <laughs> Right, we're just under half health now. Do we try and grind it out and get the kill? Or do we go up in surface so we're definitely safe? Oh, it's hard to tell. I think we could let it grind a little bit more. Yes! Look at that. Is there any extras on there? <gasps> oh, oh, what? <laughs> what? I didn't know they had that on them. <gasps> what? Oh my days. I didn't know they had that on them. Man, look at that. That's enough to tame two of them things. Two of the big underwater beds. Mastercraft metal pick, yes please. A ramshackle. What, why would you drop a ramshackle? Oh, it's rubbish, isn't it? Apprentice. That's enough to tame two squids, guys. I cannot believe that. Oh, I'm well stoked on that. Do you know what? That's enough to tame a squid and trade someone else. So we can get, like, some real good stuff. Because we ain't ever going to want two squids, so it's not really a problem, is it? Um, whew. Well, I think we've got, we've got a couple of level ups. <laughs> I think we'll uh, just stonk that melee. Then we can get that to 3,000. I mean, 30,000 story. Oh, mate. Cool. Everyone's going to want to be my best friend on the server now. Everyone's been trying to get black pearls. And I've got 100. I've got 100 of the bezlers, can you believe? I've got to get them up to my base. That's going to be a mission. They, they're not light. I think I'm just going to quickly drop this gear off in my boat and then spawn back up the top so I can run down with someone with a bit of weight on we'll get this moved over madness, absolute madness right so if we've got a yellow drop come down I just dropped all the stuff off at my base as well I thought I'd test this Mastercraft pick see how much we actually get ah, ok so I'm never using picks and stuff to actually get metal again in my life <laughs> that was ridiculous I think primitive ones work better because they don't uh, they don't break the stone as quick if you know what I mean can't, it's my lucky day today surely what I'll get another fishing rod <laughs> it's just too good for me today <laughs> what a day on arc amazing look at this guys, it doesn't stop Michael Ankolo has laid an egg, of all things. We've, we've got an egg. That's going straight in the fridge, mate. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Look at that. We've no use of it whatsoever. Apprentice fishing rod. I really can't believe it. I'm going to have to give that to someone on the server as like a mega gift. I really can't believe it. I'm going to get some chores done until it's night time, then we'll see you. Right then. So, it's a bit dark, guys. I know you can't see much, because I'm, like, standing on top of my house. There you go. You can look at those guys. So, uh, yeah. I'm standing on top of my house in the dark. It's all going to make sense in a minute. But, uh, well stoked on getting them pearls. Oh, man, that water tame we've got now. She is a Bessie. She is a complete Bessie. She's good and proper all the round. All the time. She's perfect. She killed an alpha Mosa. I mean, come on. You can't get much better than that for a water tame. She didn't even struggle. And it's all good. We've got all them pearls, so we can go tame a squid whenever we want to now. Bosh! And, uh, yeah, so if you like the episode, hit that thumbs up button. If you haven't already and you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to come and get stuck in, there's a link in the description down below of how to do that without any further ado. 
let us let us just celebrate. <laughs> yeah. It's firework time. And I got a big one. Bosh. <laughs> A lot of fireworks everywhere. Love it. <laughs> awesome. See you next time. Bye.